beautiful today. Warm wind, no rain, magnificent, splendid, beautiful scenery. My beautiful Somerset, everyone. Look at it. Fairy clouds, cotton bud clouds, with some whiskey ones as well, whisking and whisking away. I'm still looking out for deer. They said, um, like a bank like that is the sort of place a deer might have a rest. Somewhere there, see? So now we're coming down. Don't forget, we'll do the rugged route tomorrow. Which will encompass some of the features I could see from down there. I don't know if we're going near them today. I don't know. I'll get back on the grass. It's, it's kinder to the feet. Yeah, I don't think it's signposts. It doesn't tell you. It's, there was a turning back there, which could have taken me down to that village of Bosington, whatever you call it. It's not very clear when they they don't really um give, they give you very very few good markers. That's all I'm saying throughout the whole of this walk, uh, and that's starting at uh, Minehead. Then you'll get. A lot of guesswork, I have to ask a lot of people. Then suddenly you'll get some really brightly coloured, pretty little... That's all you get and you don't get anymore. Well, I'm just going to home in over there. Where Dunkery Beacon is, right on the top. There's Dunkery Beacon, look. You can actually see a few people on the top there. And then, it was shining in the sunshine a minute ago. Um, there it is. That's the long little road that you can... I, I had to climb up quite a bit of that. When I came off from a side Dunster Lane track there, I came off and joined that road and went up. And there's some carns I want to see. There they are. Robin and Joan Carn. the carns. Robin Howe and Joan Howe, or Joanna Howe, that's their cairns. And that's what I'm going to go and see before I go home. And I'm going to be driving Alberta up there. Plan A. That'll be Friday, actually. Not Thursday, that's Friday. At least at the moment, with it being warm, we can uh, actually have the door open on the caravan, on the camper van, let some air in. While it's nice, the spiders stay out, you see. They stay out and sun themselves. And they can catch insects. They can catch insects. Yeah. See, once you know where you are, you can just drive off, see? Find all these places. But when you've got a... I don't like moving Alberta once I've set her up, really. I try to use trains, buses, and my legs to get about when I get to a campsite. I hate uprooting her because I get everything out and then you've got to put it all away if she's your main vehicle. Oh, God views. That's fantastic, isn't it? What's that there? There's a church somewhere along there they told me about. They said it's worth that going for on that walk. But you see, every time you go on a walk, someone will say, oh, if you just go another couple of miles up there, and in the end you're, you're doing the whole of the coast of England, because it, it's, it is so beautiful, um, and there's so much to see, basically, that that's what happens. You have so much to see and enjoy. 
Now we come to a beacon here. Not a beacon, a pillar. But all we know, we've got to keep going on. And yet you could you could bear off and go somewhere. Is that the village of Bossington, for example? We don't tell you on that pillar. That could take you to um a village. They're not showing you where things are going. That's what's annoying. They're not showing you. Mind you, I can see another little sign here. A stumpy little one in the ground that you could easily miss. Oh, and some wild ponies. Oh, loads of ponies. No deer, though. But loads of ponies. From my campsite, I can see this big hill up here. I'm hoping to see Gilberta. I can home in on her in a minute. Yeah, see look, this little tiny stumpy little thing, look. Tiny little stumpy thing. Right, over and out. Over and out for a minute. I was right down all there. Yesterday I'd done all that. It's making you feel knackered, isn't it? A bit. <sighs> Don't know if you'll see it before I see that. I think it's a bit further in. In the town. I don't know. I'm going to go this way anyway. I want to go this way. Something tells me to go this way. Even though that's probably the village. Oh. I want to go down over there. God, isn't it beautiful, everyone? There's so much to see. I am. I really ain't got the same capacity I had a few years back. Um, You know, not, not, not like I used to. But I'm trying my best at 66 to um, get round. Thought I'd come down here just have a little look. Got past all those horses in a minute. 